Let's do more of this game here. If you're watching this later on YouTube, thanks for clicking, by the way. I just saw that another green flower appeared. I mean, that's good. Just, I don't think I got anything else, we'll see. At the very least, that's almost done. Eh, a couple more days, we'll just keep appearing and it's fine. Art sales is here. So at least I'll have a chance of getting art that I don't have. I forgot I was wearing this. <laughs> this, like, bootlegger rabbits outfit. Well, I mean, something grew here. It's not what I want. It's after. That is something that I want, though. Another red. Of course, of course the rock had to appear here. Um... I guess let's just do this. The thinker, huh? And the Ferris Bueller painting. I guess this is the only one I'm interested in because I already got the Mona Lisa. I think that's an original one. I'm just checking the statues. The Thinker. Familiar statue, okay. It's always genuine. Well. Wow. Let me just check. But I'm pretty certain I don't have it. As I figured, I've got that one. I have the Ferris Bueller painting. <laughs> and... Mona Lisa. So, it's, yeah, just that statue, which I don't think I have. Okay. I'll go get it.
interest. <laughs> at, least it, at least this gave me something. I was worried because nothing was growing here. So this will join the others. I need to get rid of these. My yacht. And I get to see how much a yacht costs and real money. Island life. What is this? <laughs> okay, I know this song. Putting away the stuff I don't need. I'm 
mean, it's getting to the point where I should now transfer a couple of these across. Oh, look what finally grew. Hang on, let me look up windflowers. No, wait, this isn't a hybrid one. Get rid of it. Right, so this can go. You know, hopefully these can be self-sufficient and just grow more of them. is near. It's really just three flowers I need. I guess I may as well place the wall that I just bought. Just to finish this off. So then that's concealed. <laughs> Not open. I mean, it's still, I guess, kind of open. Better? That might be better. Yeah, that's better. That actually looks concealed. Alright, cool. I mean, showers next to a carnival, it's fine. Okay, cool. I get the daily stuff out of the way as quick as I can. Good. I think that's three of them now. But I'm gonna get a model of this next. Okay, even though I did put this all here for the flies, like, I got my fly. Why is the fish big? I mean, it's an ocean fish. 
Would you be shocked to hear that they're bigger than that in real life? <laughs> Wait, my oh, Alright, um... It's okay, it's a game, it doesn't have to make sense. If I can stab a rat in other games and get, like, an entire piece of armor from it, I can catch a gigantic fish with, like, a fishing rod that would probably snap in two and drag me into the ocean. Yeah, look up a photo of one in real life, like, they're pretty massive. I wonder if there's like a treasure chest item in this. No, come on, there's room. How big is this thing? I was right, it's just being awkward and weird. Um, hang on. Let me pick this up. How did I do it? I was facing that way. Hang on. Oh, can't go any further. Okay. I kind of wanted the anchor next to it. Yeah, I mean like that. Something like that. <laughs> oh, no, I'll get other stuff related to this and just chuck it in the back here. I think the funniest logic is just being able to do this. <laughs> the magic pockets. I need to get my fossils. I'm gonna go get the other truck customized and move this tree out of the way. Eventually I'll set up like a food truck spot. Once I'm done with all this flower business. I guess I may as well water them on here.
Hold on, hold on. What are you thinking about? Ah. Oh. Fine. Fine. <laughs> Are we going to play the game? There we go. Okay, if I lose this, man, that... Like, come on, it has to be higher. <laughs> oh, not that much higher. Okay, well, I won. I'm out. Painter's overalls? the other fossils now. No, don't put the truck away. Keep it. That goes away. Okay. I guess while I'm here, I may as well go buy the the watering can. Drinking fountain, glow in the dark stickers. Hmm. If I have a lot of stone, the drinking fountain might be worth making. for a sec, the middle one was missing. remember if I have this. I'll just get it. Just thinking of like other little stalls I can make. If this island takes place in like <laughs> an area anywhere close to where I am, it's important to have a place that sells umbrellas.
Uh, where is it? I put them away. No! No. Oh no, they they will scam me a hundred percent. The truck is worth a bit of money, there's no way they're gonna trade me for something. Some mystery object that'll be anywhere close to what the truck's worth. carrying cosmetic items is just they always ask to buy them they'll just run across look all happy and then they want to rip you off <laughs> most of the time oh, the sword one was the best it's like hey that sword you just bought that for 90,000 bells right how about I give you 5,000 bells
I might be able to just start grabbing stuff for Alice. I think I haven't really watered the flowers up there or anything, so I could probably get rid of them, move them. Not surprised. Oh. It's actually the final milestone. There's no coffee, right? Yeah, there's no coffee. made out of again? It's like, I think it's just stone. Did it say drinking fan or a bird bath? I think it said bird bath. Just to do the hot item thing. Drinking fountain. So then that's another recipe that involves iron. Okay. Well, I'll just craft one. I forgot that I don't have much of this left. Drinking fountain. I just thought about it. I should probably have some of these scattered around the place. I'll make a few. realize what it should be. Change change of mind. Should be this. This will match the the brickwork I have.
thinking of other places where there should be one. And probably here wouldn't be a bad idea. one here. Oh. Even better. Oh yes, there is this room. Here we are. near the campground makes sense. Somewhere here I'll figure out the actual placement of it later. Hangs on the wall. I don't know. So the thing that I've been curious about Do I have that? I'm not sure I have that. I'll check it in a minute. Oasis, I think it was called. Does not look like I have it. the damage. 260,000 for a yacht. Wait, so it equates to like roughly the same pokey? 
Huh. Okay, well. Second job. All right, I'll leave it for now. I forgot to sell the drinking fountain. I mean, this would sell pretty well. Iron and... And stone. Okay, let's dump. I just want to customize the truck. I guess I may as well get the fortune while I'm there. Checked you this week? I don't think I have. Ow, yeah, I haven't. I mean, not that I think I'll do anything with this. Okay. Wait, what's this one? Oh, okay. Oh, 
Alright, let's get this truck customized. See, at least this is put to good use. It's like, two of them will have it. We'll probably go with yellow. of things once I get back from the daily island yeah this definitely has to go for now <laughs> I'll just park him here oh see if it's facing this way it looks dumb I mean, okay, that angle. I mean, look, I'm leaving it here temporarily. I have an idea for this, it's just whether or not it'll pan out. Anyway. Go do this first. Waiting for the background to fully change the special island. It's a low chance, but it's still hopeful. Yeah, I think it would have happened by now. like less than a 4% chance. I'll just grab the stuff quickly. Wait, what was that? Oh. That was the 50th trip. Nice. <laughs> Free trip. Yeah, there's nothing really special going on here. This, however, might be an arowana. Hmm. 
No, it's an Arapaima. Still, it's good money. Um, yeah, there's not really anything else I would want from this. I guess one of the actions was like planting a fruit tree so and chopping a tree down, so let's do this. I may as well do the same here. Not to sell fruit anyway, and I need fruit. So then I can get, well, move the rock, get rid of the two, move the tree, get rid of the two rocks. So what, I need five, uh, eight. Eight turtle. All right, one more. Okay. And then sell that stack. All right. Don't care about the gyroid, and yeah, the island isn't in a different season, so I'm out. anything. Does he always ask that if I don't dig up anything? He only seems to ask when I f don't dig up the gyroid. Almost like he's saying, hey, you'd forget something. Just to make room. Okay. I forget how this works. I think I have to face this way. Eh, I mean, kind of. Yeah, that'll, that'll do it. Hang on. Mm, 
No, you know what? I guess the way I had it the first time is correct. It makes sense, because for this to be backed up, like, right next to the river is dumb. <laughs> There'd be some kind of barricade here preventing such a thing from happening. Because I am lazy. I guess I need another one, eh? Hmm. I'd have to go get it. didn't exactly do what I wanted it to. Oh. Yeah, okay. Hold on. It has to be done this way. I suppose the other way to do it would be with hedges. Yeah, maybe hedges might work better. Oh, it's in a position where I can't actually push it. Alright, let me get two hedges. If I would have known, I would have brought them with me. Oh well. Orange and yellow. Match the trucks. There we go. And that's about all I'm going to do on this for now. They're in position. It's just... I need to be done with this. balloon. Yeah, I did. Okay, I gotta wait. deal with this. I'm getting rid of both of these.
Oops. It's kind of annoying that they appeared here. Disassemble this whole thing. It's the money rock. Again. I guess I got to organize it properly now. a whole lot, but probably here. Yeah, I think I'll move these. I mean, I haven't really done anything with them, so... I may as well set up that garden. Okay. Fruit. I was like, what am I even selling? The fruit. Okay, customization kits. Okay. 
Okay, so for Alice's place, I had a specific idea. At least for the flowers. I was gonna loosely base it off the stuff that I see around here. So I'm gonna see if I can replicate. first. Okay. Alright, so what we see around here is like Let me work with this as well. It's like, well, now this has pattern. And then, well, that, that, and then the green ones this way. Although, hang on, I'm gonna change it because the green ones are gonna be mums, so. Whoops. kind of yellow should put maybe this might not be a bad idea whoops Okay. 
Voilà. Voilà. This will be green. If I have any other random yellow lilies around. Oh, there's one. That's fine. And yet it allows this. So just, I don't know, go with. easier this way. match like that. I think that's fine. Ooh, this is going to be tough. I wonder if this will work. This is the thing I'm curious about. Not. 
had an idea in my head, but I don't think it's looking like I think it's gonna look. Hey, Star, how's it going? How's your day been? Maybe I'm just overthinking it. on uh, sick or just just feeling like poo Just hurting all over, no idea why. Oh, maybe you slept funny. Um, but yeah, I'm doing all right. Just wrapped up work. <laughs> just been a pretty busy week, so I'm looking forward to the week being over. I'm just working on a villager's house because I kind of realize I haven't really done much here. I've just had a bunch of flowers that I don't, I'm not really watering anymore, so I figured may as well try to lay something down. So, like, thematically with this, I'm going with what I generally see on my walks and stuff around here. So like the flower colors, black, yellow, orange, and green. Actually kind of similar to this. I guess by that logic that should be black, huh? Should get another black one. I just need more green ones, but the green ones are coming out pretty well. my flower stockpile. Yeah, other than that, not a whole lot. I hit my knee on <laughs> on my uh my what do you call it little little table that I have in the living room, it's like a Peter Griffin moment. Just I guess that's what makes that so funny. It's like if you do hit your knee that hard, you do you do tend to do that. We'll see how I feel tomorrow. If I feel it like, like ten times worse, then I'm probably getting old. Okay, so Alice is gonna own a yacht, so I'm gonna open this up so then the yacht can go out this way.
assholes are your 40 and you're falling apart. <laughs> Yeah, it's only a matter of time. I haven't really had, like, a defining old man moment yet. Aside from that, that thing that I tried to buy on Amazon where it said it was specifically for, for pensioners. I'm sorry. Do boomers own convenience? When did that become a thing? I gotta wait here. another cooking thing. Okay. <laughs> well, I mean, I've already purchased the yacht for tomorrow. I guess I should... That's when I'll figure out more of it. I'll probably park the yacht here. I don't know if I want to do myself. I'll see what decorations I have. We'll try to keep this loosely based on, like, Australia. Because you do find these trees here, as weird as it might sound. I don't know about the cactus. I know we have cactus, but maybe not that big. Oh, right, I forgot one. Yeah. Wait, not that, not that, not that. Radio's playing the song in the background. I wasn't paying attention to it until I heard the, the sound effect. Forever burned in the brain. But yeah, well, once you hear it, you can't unhear it. You know... Someone ruined, um, a song for me. It was, um, Mr. Brightside by The Killers. I, I can't listen to that song without thinking a particular thing. <laughs> it's just... The song... What's that? Do you want me to ruin the song for you? I won't say what it is, but I'll, I'll link you to a tweet that got sent to me once, if I can find it quickly. But it's gonna change the way you, you think about the song, that's, that's the warning I give. When I hear that song, I can't think of it any other way now, it's just... I have to look for a specific keyword in my, my messages. Yep, there it is. You never listen to it, that's fine, okay. Well, 
that's it, though. But if you're out and about in here... Uh... I suppose it also depends if you know the ref... well, the person. Or the thing it's trying to get you to be reminded of. apple tree on me. I mean, you don't really hear it. I hear it. I don't know why. Maybe it's just one of those things that just the thought of, a, of the picture coming up in your head. I can just visualize it. I mean, everyone's different. There's like that whole... I forgot what it was. It's been a while since you watched the show, so I guess your voice wasn't really stuck in your head. Oh, Seinfeld was like... something that my dad watched every day. Like, when it was... Because it was a primetime show. It was like... reruns of it constantly, and even then, when it was airing at the time, it was just like a big thing. So my dad was big on that. So that was a show that just was always on. Even I have like... You know, watch some random episodes here and there as I got older. So, to me, that voice is like, it's burnt into my brain. Whenever that song plays, I just can't think of anything else. It's like how, um, oh, that, that Lazy Town song. I forgot what it's called. But there's like a remix with Little John and the East Side Boys, and whenever I hear the song, I just expect Little John to just start rapping at any point. I just don't associate the original song anymore with... Yeah. Oh, those edits are great. I wonder what he's doing these days. Not that I've been keeping up with his stuff, but like... What does a hype man do when he's no longer the hype? stuff around. I got to see him live, it was just, it was a concert, and f he was touring with 50 Cent. Like, he opened for 50. Man, some of those songs with the speakers they were using, you could feel your whole insides vibrate. It's great. Scattering these around. I 
Oh. Oh, I see. It's because, yep, it's a corner tile. That's why. Alright, I guess the rest of them I'll just throw here for now. I guess I should craft the wall that I just got. I mean... I never know. There could be something in the happy home thing where I feel like it would make sense thematically. see what I have just to be able to decorate out there. So, let's see. Beach town? Eh. Tub. I don't think I've given anyone a hot tub. I don't know. I don't think Australians are very hot tub culture. Maybe I could lead into the comedy of just like, well, just put spiders everywhere <laughs> and this around it. Oh, because you know, Australia's covered in spiders according to most of the world. I don't think I have enough spiders to do that. Oh. I mean, that is very, like, out in the middle of nowhere, but... Never thought they were covered in spiders. You know, they exist everywhere. And they're bigger than here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's just... How, how can I put it? It's... I guess people think that they're in more places than they are, are really. When it comes to where humans live. Like... Like I've said it before, it's... Australia is a big country, so when you look at the percentage of where there's dangerous animals, it's a high percentage of the landmass. However, we don't really live 
we don't really live in most places of Australia. Like, we're all kind of cluttered along the coast, so... Those places, unless you're talking about the far north, the far north is basically Florida. It's like, yeah, the whole thing with gators is like, we got crocodiles and... Just all that stuff. The big spiders, they come from there. The largest spider I've seen in my entire life, like, within the context of, like, where I live, where... I, anywhere I've lived, probably the size of... Like, what can I... Hmm, I'm thinking. Like a golf ball, maybe? That, that it was a tarantula and it was the size of a golf ball. Which, in terms of gigantic spiders, not that big. And that was a once-off thing. Like I can't say I've seen anything. Everything on average is like, just the size of one of your smaller coins. Yeah, it's like, it's not that bad. It's just when you go out in the middle of nowhere, that's when, yeah, the odds increase of finding spiders that have their own health bar. I really don't have much to go with what I have out here. I bought a bunch of cube lights, but I'm not going to use them for that. Let's see how this looks. It's okay, like... I think asking about dangerous animals in Australia is like a perfectly normal question. But sometimes you get questions like, do you guys celebrate, like, a holiday that the entire world celebrates that comes up every now and then? Like, one of the big ones, like, Easter or Christmas. Like, okay, I know the country is, like, literally on the opposite ends of the Earth, but, you know, we did used to be, like, a British colony. <laughs> well, I guess we technically still are. I mean, hmm... It's a bit overkill. It's just not the right setting for this. It needs to be more jungle-like. I might go through the Happy Home catalog and see if there's anything I can order. I'll go to the happy home stuff now. <laughs> Just saying hi, Scoot. I really, I really want to make him stand behind this. Some countries don't recognize Christmas as a holiday, but it's stuff like Afghanistan, Saudi Arabia, North Korea and stuff. Yeah. No, like, I, I definitely know con there are countries and, I guess, like, groups of people that don't celebrate it. 
But I guess the perception of Australia not being a country that's like up there with the US, Canada, the UK. Like, yeah. <laughs> it's like, oh no, those, those Australians, they're like... Isn't- don't they, like, live in junkyards and they construct machines with garbage? And then they have, like, page matches? I thought I saw a documentary on that. <laughs> they played too much Overwatch. Dude, do you know- do you know what the fucking funny thing is? Junkrat as a character does- an Australian guy, I'm pretty sure the dude that does the voice probably got off him, but there's an Australian dude who has that exact voice. Did commercials in the 90s, it's fucking hysterical. It's like Junkrat trying to sell you shit. <laughs> when I heard Junkrat's voice, I was like, wait a minute, why does this sound so familiar? Like, why is this bringing up a core cool memory? And then some, one of my friends just like, Pointed out, it's like, oh, dude, Junkrat, that's like that guy from TV. Oh, I'll have to try and find the video, but it's fucking funny. Oh, Leopold's here. Okay. I'll go in here first. Excuse me, I like the design of this, I just admittedly make a, made a mistake. Because it's hard to get through. Do I have that? I guess I don't. Okay. There, I found it. I found it. I found it. Okay. Just scroll up through Discord messages. I was trying to remember what what did I what did I send that this as? All right, got it. That that is that is junk rat, hundred percent. The funny thing was, was just I thought, oh, well, this is not an Australian accent, Junkrat, and then just core memory on the lock. I was like, but why does this feel familiar? Well, that's why. It's like someone actually has the accent. Or the voice. Oh, it's... I'm gonna buy that. Wind chime? Whoa, that is expensive. Looks nice, though. I'm just gonna... Oh, cool. It's a good exchange rate as well. Okay. As much as possible. I mean, I guess I'm not going to use it. It's fine. Probably their reference material for here's what we want them to sound like. It's just such a weird, obscure reference, though. 
I mean, it's great if someone knew who that guy was and referenced it, like... I just, even, I don't think most Aussies would be able to pick it out. It's one of these things that... You're gonna, you're gonna feel like you've heard his voice before, but you won't know where, and... For someone to remember is, is just such a shot in the dark. I guess it's one of those things where it's it's just such a dumb joke that it's funnier when someone understands what the dumb joke is. But that guy wasn't even that unhinged. I guess his voice sounded unhinged, but there were plenty of other unhinged TV personalities back then. Oh, those look kind of nice. Very decorative. So, hold on. We're going to expand the hospital, right? Expand it. That was the task that I was up to. Okay, I guess 20 minutes, because it's just adding another wing. The patient ward. Okay, well... No, I want to go upstairs, I'm trying to. Also... <laughs> the patient ward using a flight of stairs. Oh, wow, this is tiny. Not what I was expecting at all. This, I mean, what kind of patient ward are we looking at here? <laughs> it's a different kind of patient ward. <laughs> Not only is it small, but it's like... What kind of patients are we locking up in here? Okay, that's better. Jeez. Okay, there we go. We need windows for this place. Alright. You can adjust the size of these ones. You can't adjust the size of your own house, unfortunately. But these ones, at least, you can adjust the size. Alright. So, 20 minutes, start now. I probably should have looked at the flooring I had, but... That's fine. Alright. Um, stuff that looks like hospital flooring, that's good enough. We're going very standard here. A vent. It's supposed to be a window, but it does look like a vent. If I change this, it'll change this. Okay. Yeah, see, some of them look like windows. No, you're right, it did look like a vent. But I guess they're supposed to be those annoying shutters. I hate those things. I'm trying not to make it look like a bathroom in here. I mean, hospital walls, they're, like, very simple. They don't go super artsy. Yeah. You know, the, I, I realized that I picked a window, but... Maybe I can go, hang on. That. And then just change the style now. the heck? I think this is fine. Yeah, this is fine. I'll align them that way. Okay, and now... Um, I guess the part... Oh. That's one thing I didn't think through, because it's gonna be this. Which, not exactly what I wanted. Alright, so I guess I'll have to go curtains. Okay, curtains and bed first. Hospital bed. Modern hospital bed. This one. That feels more correct. 
Okay. That bothers me. <laughs> but okay. Um. All right. Let's just get the separations going. This. This is going to be easy. Like, I'm not going to count this as my big creative thing for the day. It's just uh, getting this done. Okay, and then I guess the visitor chairs are like... Something like this. I don't have normal brown. What else have we got? I don't I don't like the colours. That's it, really? I mean, I guess I can go this and then just make it look less Okay, that's better. Um Something a little more muted. Hmm. Guess that, that's fine. Yeah, that works. Okay, visit a chat. Alright, now hospital equipment we need. Uh, b b b b hospital equipment. I know it's like somewhere down the bottom here. Okay, here we go. Uh... The IV drip. <laughs> Operating cart. Well, I guess I can keep some supplies along here. I don't know. Like I might make like a storage room. What else is there? Wash basin. Okay, I mean... I could probably do one more. Just do this. Oops. Someone gets like a deluxe, a <laughs> deluxe room. Oh, the windows behind- oh, the windows behind do not make sense. Too many windows. Um, yeah, I don't like that. I'm gonna change it. Honestly, that's not bad. But now this is... <laughs> Alright, 
Alright, screw it. <laughs> Getting rid of the windows. Don't use. There we go. Alright, that's fine. Okay, uh, ceiling stuff. I could have fixed it if I wasn't interested in in time. I could have fixed it. This is stock standard template. Everyone gets a single plant in their room. Okay. Um, lights are gonna be simple. I'm gonna pretend that these are these are TVs. And not something that's just displaying like a PowerPoint presentation. So let's just pretend these are this is their entertainment. The power of imagination. Why is that not aligning? Oh, now it is. I don't know. Okay. Sure. <laughs> Just ignore. Okay. Yeah, there's some new stuff. This doesn't have to be too much. No. That's just something I had to do. Doesn't have to be over the top. I guess realistically, that should be partitioned off as well, for privacy. There we go. Man, these panels are just so versatile. Alright, and then that's storage, okay. And now... Where are they? They're somewhere down the bottom. Look at that out. Um, yeah, this, this, and this. Ooh, they're not gonna. F I'll make them fit. I'll sacrifice valuable space to make. Make a place where you can get snacks. Because that's what you do at a hospital, you get snacks. to do. Like that. Accidentally put that away, my bad. No, no, storage room. Um, 
a, a desktop computer. <laughs> That'd be very morbid as like, put a pile of bones on the bed. Oh, you can't. Oh, well. Somewhere down the bottom. There's so much stuff now. Okay, it's around here. Yeah, there it is. Desktop. Okay. Nurse's computer. And just some papers. Document stack. That'll do. Alright, we need a chair. Ah, I mean, pretty standard. Okay, next. Okay, what I'm gonna do, I'm going to swap this and this. Someone got gifted a giant teddy bear. So for that to work, I need to put this here again. I'm just thinking of, like, little presents. Okay, um, I'll get a plant for the next one. Would that even be a, oh, maybe this, like a flower stand. Yeah, hey, that'll work. If it would fit, um... Would this fit? This one would fit, surely. Yep, this will fit. Okay, so then... They're getting... F uh... Really? I'll make an exception. They don't get <laughs> an important piece of medical equipment. So they can get flowers. Sacrifices have to be made. Just seeing what else we got. That doesn't mean else I would really the place. This last one's gonna have like a gift or something. That could work. Alright, that works. It's the deluxe suite. They got their own little private quarter thing. Alright, that's fine. Well, I got a couple of minutes. Too big. Hmm. 
maybe. No. Nah. Three by two. Four by three, two by one. I guess I could, this could work. Wait, no it won't. There's no one doing this. <laughs> At least I don't think so. Uh, yeah, maybe I should just leave it be. I think it's fine. Okay, other little things that I should probably put. Exit sign. Just for regulations. Of course this has to be in it. Um, block. So, that. I haven't used this one before. I can use this one now. Nah, yeah, that's fine. But other than that, I think I'm good. Oh, I could probably customize a huge bear. There we go. <laughs> Not use the stock standard one. Guess make a match. Yeah, I think I'm good. It's a time up anyway. is a functional hospital. It is not very creative. Okay, cool. I just want the pokey so then I can buy an air conditioning unit for the island and I can put them inside my venue. That's all that's missing from it. <laughs> Leave it as it's. That's my theme, is just whatever, whatever the place is, it's just going to be no something here. Oh, it's showing off the whole thing. Looks like I picked the same walls, so that's good. This poor mouse is overworked. <laughs> One doctor to cover all of this. I'm not trying this off very well. <laughs> These angles are not good. I mean, ad admittedly, it's the walls that are doing it. It's okay. Is that doc just sleeping in the bed? I'm not a patient. I mean, that's cool showcasing the back of the TVs.
you act are you actually sick? Hey. 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 I mean, they do look like... It does... I don't know. Where, where's that chart that measures someone's pain by the look of it the, on their face? I need that chart. Okay, well, I'm done here. Oh, I wanna... I guess do that. That one plant over their head, it's fine. See, plants, they... They, uh, they are part of the circle of life and... We breathe in the oxygen and then breathe out carbon dioxide. So the plant is close your face so then it picks up that carbon dioxide and converts it to oxygen so then you get like a fresh stream of oxygen what about when it falls on their head ah I mean it's fine it's not gonna fall on their head I think the bigger question is, why is there a whole second floor with hospital beds? There's no bathroom up there or an elevator. They have to take the stairs. Okay, and then we do a house. It's been a while since I've done stuff, so... Bonus. Because that one was admittedly very boring. <laughs> Alright. But first, I can finally order this thing. Well, does Would anyone have a pink air conditioner? Or a blue one? Like, that, I would imagine, is still in the realm of possibilities. Same with that and this, but... Pink and blue. Okay. I did it. Now let me see if there's anything else I'm interested in. That lady who's obsessed with pink dolls. Her whole house is pink. But would she have bought a pink air conditioner? Or would she have bought the air conditioner and gotten someone to customize the air conditioner? and spray paint it pink. Like, I'm sure she would have a pink one, it's more just how the pink one was acquired. <laughs> pink air conditioner unit. Okay, I mean, they exist, but the portable ones. The portable ones are pink. And then there's, there's a company that, um... ...customizes the color. But I don't think there's a company that straight up provides the color pink. <laughs> as part of their, like, standard stock. Camp. School's infirmary. Why? That is such a weird idea for a holiday place. Yeah, it would definitely be customized. Island resort vibes. Very generic. Flowers. Jungle. Hidden tra- Ooh. I like it. I like it. I'm kind of setting up like a... Maybe 
yeah, let's see this one. Hopefully there's stuff like a treasure chest, that'd be cool. Wait, hey, 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 hey. No one said anything about a gym. A gym? <laughs> I got bamboozled. Just for that, you're going here. I thought this was going to be like a treasure theme thing. One level. You got one level. Well. What a weird theme. Treasure pack gym. What does that even mean? Okay, um... I'll go 10 minutes outside. Starting now. Alright, let's be quick. You went too far down this rabbit hole. Even her dogs are pink. What do you mean her dogs are pink? She specifically got white dogs that she temporarily dyes their hair pink. Wow. Wow. <laughs> oh, okay. No, that, 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 there's treasure stuff. There's treasure stuff. But you know what I'm going to do? I'm gonna make it that all the treasure stuff is like over here. At least some is like a pile of coins. There's no pile of coins. I mean, this could work. sword and the stone. What I'm gonna do is like, you know, his theme is that he has been following this treasure hunt this whole time and can't figure out where the treasure is. So I'll make a table for him. Has to be a big table if you're planning. Kind of like a treasure hunt headquarters. Does that work? I hate, I, it's just these. I guess this is this is functional. Okay. What's the most uh, outside other than her dogs? What's the most ridiculous thing that she's made pink? Okay, we have dumb rabbit holes we go down sometimes. It's literally everything. <laughs> 
You'd go insane in her house. Oh no. One funny rabbit hole went down was like just gigantic things that have been made with food. That was like a 40 minute rabbit hole. And we just looked into what's the dumbest thing that's been made with food. And the dumbest one we could find was like they made Mount Rushmore out of beef jerky. And it's a it's 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 as gigantic and as stupid as you think. <laughs> it's just man. I mean kind of impressive, but at the same time, still very dumb. Oh. Interesting. I might save that for inside. I mean, this could work. The weirdest pink thing, she has a giant pink... She has giant pink eyelashes on her car. I have to see this in a minute. But I'm on the clock right now. later. <laughs> oh boy. So there's no treasure chest item. That's a little sad. Doesn't fit. I mean, about three minutes. I mean, this whole thing is like a gym, so I, I guess I'll put up. See that? Uh, you know what? Screw his gym idea. <laughs> I'll put some of that inside. I don't think out here is going to be too, too complicated. She looks good for being 60s, though. Crazy to think she makes a living off loving the color pink. Yeah, I mean, sometimes you're fortunate enough to make a living off something that you enjoy or as a hobby. Or just, yeah, a niche thing. You can definitely say some of the stuff is strange for sure, but I'll power to her for, like, being able to do that as a living. I would not complain. <laughs> It's funny though, I think about like that news lately that made fun of that kid for being so excited over the Tetris score thing. 
And it's just like, I bet if she did an interview with this lady that, like, decorated her house pink, she'd probably be super supportive about it. Just like, oh yeah, you know, that's great. Maybe red. Guys, the house. You need treasure hunting stuff. The news reporter lady is, is done. Yeah. Maybe not that. Sure. Just a bunch of gold stuff. It's a cursed island, like, the bones are a deterrent. I think this looks good already. I think I'm good. I like it. There's only 30 seconds left anyway. She doesn't seem to understand what... Understand people doing what they love. She seems to be like a tiger mom. I mean, I think she'd be skeptical. Skeptical. Like, weirded out by it. But I don't think she'd make some of the comments she made about the kid. Like, her attitude was basically get a life. I don't think that would be... Anything that would remotely cross their mind, it'd be like, oh, yeah, it's strange, but, you know, hey. <laughs> Loving the color pink is not a life goal, like, oh, man. Just, yeah, oh, yeah, no, everything. Humans have to be 100% optimal with their choices in life. They cannot do anything that makes them happy. Like, how just miserable do you have to be to think that way? That's simple. I like it. Okay. I mean, I had... It would have been cool if it was just a treasure hunter's, um, house, but this whole, like, oh, it's gym? Like, why- why is... Why is fitness being brought into this? <laughs> okay, well, I've already done. Do you know how heavy those chests are? They're full of loot. Oh, man, that just reminds me of, like, the Nathan Fielder thing, where he just convinced people of a fake celebrity endorsing an exercise program that involved moving furniture. And just a bunch of people are just moving furniture. Thinking they were a part of some fancy exercise program. Oh, man. Alright, 20 minutes start now. We could do the same thing. Go hunt treasure as an exercise program. It's smart. Oh, Nathan Few is just... Some of the ideas he's ha has in it, it's... They're clever, but also sometimes it's just like, man... Dude, uh, just... The lengths people will go to for certain things. I mean, I guess I can make this a little rundown, it's fine. Treasure hunter. Think about treasure hunting. The other one's the, uh... Where he convinced the gas station to start a rebate program, and they would just make the process of getting rebate extremely tedious, and just... The lengths people went to to just save a couple dollars, it was like... I'm all for the whole thing where it's sometimes it's a matter of principle. I get that. Sometimes that is important. But, dude, for that, it's like, you're talking about a couple of dollars and the stuff they were doing to make sure they got their two dollars. <laughs> when you're broke, you'll do it, otherwise rebates fall into a black hole for you. But would you go to a mountain and camp out for days 
and go on, like, hikes that involve multiple miles. To save a couple dollars. Have I seen extreme couponing? Uh, I have not, because... It's not... I mean, we do have sales here in Australia, but I don't think, like... There's, like, a coupon culture here. I, I can't say I've ever seen that. But I've seen it on TV. That's the extent I've seen couponing. Like, we have... Stores have, like, their membership cards, and then they send out catalogs. Yeah, coupons aren't a thing here, either. Like, I think that's a very American thing. But yeah, they do loyalty programs instead. Mainly select grocery stores. Ah, gotcha. But I mean, hey, you do I mean you do what you gotta do to make ends meet, right? Like I mean my parents were immigrant refugees and growing up it's just like sometimes you do what you have to do. But there's also just, like, the sunken cost fallacy. It's just... At a certain point... Them being there trying to save a couple of dollars is losing them money in the long run, because they could be doing other things. It's not even make ends meet. They fill their whole garage with mini a mini grocery store because their coupons stack up. They get stuff for pennies. It's insane. Okay, no, I have not seen that. That I have not seen. That's a new idea for me. That's probably another rabbit hole. They just strategically do it in a way to maximize their money and make money back sometimes. Huh. So what, it's like the thrill of chasing a bargain, I guess? I mean, this dude's hunting treasure, he doesn't have time for dishes. Um... Yeah, music. You know, I've never given anyone a washing machine. They get because they are a treasure hunter, right? They get to they get a whole planning, whole thing for planning. They brainstorm on on this. None of <laughs> blank. It's gonna be blank for now. The gym aspect of it, I guess I'll do here. There we go, that's the gym aspect. Hang on, I'm missing out on chat for a minute. Okay, so that's the planning room. This will be the little studio for gym, a kitchen, still need a lounge area to chill, there was a TV show about a 10 years ago, maybe it's not a thing anymore, some do it just to ride for the fam, many are stay at home moms and some do it to help homeless shelters, reasons vary, huh. Yeah, I mean, I'm intrigued for sure. <laughs> Just, it's not, it's not a thing that I can. I guess I can visualize because that culture of couponing. We, I mean, okay. The now that I think about it, the closest thing I've seen to couponing 
or at least getting coupons is like, um, I don't know if it's still a thing, but when I was a kid, there used to be this book that they would send in the mail, but a lot of that was like for food places, so like KFC, Pizza Hut, um, all those places would put coupons, so like for meal deals. That's about it, but like for grocery things, it was, there was a catalog that you'd get in the mail like once a week and it would just tell you what um, was on sale that week. And you would just have to go the day it started, otherwise you had no chance of getting the items you wanted. I think that, yeah, that's like the extent of what I remember my my parents doing coupons for. I'll make this like a combined place where you eat. Just to make it easier. Um, how do I have so many decorations? Um, for this in particular, as you do houses, each house has a theme and it just adds to the collection. So it starts off as like a very small collection and then as you pick villages to do homes for, um, that collection expands. So you have free access to them in this mode, but when it comes to my island, um, it's pretty much off crafting recipes and items that are in the store daily and items that I I find. So you're restricted by that. I'm just gonna put out a spread here. How much time? I got 10 minutes left. Alright, that's not too bad. Alright, um... I guess because we have to go with the whole theme of, like... I don't know why the workout place, but whatever. Like... Body is a temple, blah blah blah. I guess they can have, like, a couple of treasures. They gotta be successful in some regard. Um... So this is their planning area. I'm going to add a table. Um, what kind of chair? Basic chair. And... Actually, that's better. This game does have... does have a lot of items, like... It is... it is pretty crazy. And... I guess they kind of do it in a manner where it just... They allow you to... To make whatever you want, more or less. It's like there's a... Like the fact that I can, you know, have an idea like, Oh, I'm gonna make this villager run... A... A vet's office, for example. I can do that. Just gotta collect the items. That's why it's great that there's trading. It's... I'll put it, I don't know, here. Yeah. Just the clothing. Okay, the only thing I don't have is a sofa. I'll do this, this is fine. Okay, and needs to be some... I think that's on point for treasure hunting. 
Um, I guess I have room. I can put this further back and go... Like a little table. Again, this was like the perfect game to come out <laughs> during the pandemic. Just don't know what I would have done without it. Film projector makes sense. Eh, maybe not that. do this. Okay, I need more. I need like a treadmill or something. I can't believe like this exercise theme <laughs> was uh, incorporated into this. It's fine. I really want to be able to buy the doghouse, but it just hasn't appeared yet. Treadmill. Okay, hang on. Put this in front of this. Okay, um... Do the usual thing. Where... TV on the wall. Because this is a treasure hunter thing. This is the only time this makes sense. I haven't... I mean, uh, in the classroom I think I put one, but otherwise... Okay, we have a map. Sure, they've like been places around the world. That's my, from my trip to Australia. And where I had to fight the giant fucking bug in Australia, where I had to take it down with the boomerang. I don't know. Have we got I mean okay in terms of like we can have priceless artworks Is that the real one I think that's the real one treasure hunter makes sense Okay, um... What else have we got? I guess the knife thing? Where's the knife thing? Knife. These are some knives. Lining. Uh, 
Uh, will this fit? Yeah, well. There we go. reasons and wow I still have two minutes left okay what else can I do I mean I guess just more stuff on the walls Things that look fancy and like, ooh. I had to fight this giant swordfish when I went on my last expedition, and I had to fight it with a boomerang. <laughs> what am I doing? Just every time this dude kills something with a boomerang, he hangs up the boomerang and the kill on the wall. That's the theme. And then there was this time I had to collect these priceless paintings. And I had to fight a lion with this boomerang. Okay. I'm being an idiot, but it's okay. And then, for dinner, I <laughs> got some fish. And I had to fight it with this boomerang. Didn't eat the fish, but makes for a good decoration. Okay. I've well, got a little bit of time left, so. Yeah, that was good. That looks out of place. I'm gonna I'm just gonna get a plant and put it here. I hope. You'll do. That works. I wish I could hang stuff on these extra walls that I place. I gotta go with that one, huh? Ah, uh, it's fine. Alright, that's time. Whoops. <laughs> I mean, yeah. Hang on, I gotta turn this on. It's just... I think this would have been nicer if the theme was just treasure hunting. I don't know why they decided to go... Oh yeah, no, it's... It's a gym as well. Turning that on. Leave that off. Hey, turn that off. Turn that off. The hell? There we go. What? There we go. <laughs> it's like a delayed reaction. I mean, it was a cool theme, just the part where... Why, Jim? Anyway. It's like the next one will be, Hey, I want a cool science lab. And then you get there and they also want a bakery.
At least when it's showing this place off, it looks all right. I did my best. Good. That last job was the 30th vacation home you've been in charge of. That means we've grown our client base considerably and we've cleared our goal towards holding the event. We need to go out and celebrate. I'll leave it to you. Would you rather go to the restaurant or the cafe? The restaurant. Cafe is too small. Okay, so, like, I'm gonna scroll up. Where's that, where's that link? <laughs> the lady with the pink stuff. Oh my god, that's like, that hurt my eyes when the pink appeared on the screen. Yeah, those, those are some eyelashes. I mean... It's cool, just, just to be able to make a living doing that, that's cool. But that is extremely pink. Congrats. Everyone has juice glass, right? Okay, then let's hear it. But at a certain point, it's got to stop, right? Like... I would assume the food she consumes is not pink. <laughs> just imagine, it's just like, no, it must be pink and just adds food dye to everything. Spray paints an orange pink. <laughs> so the orange is pink. The event venue came together nicely, so I bet the event will be a huge hit. Thanks to everyone's hard work. I know it's going to be great. Oh, before I forget, Bordel, how are things going with getting a music act for the event? It's going well. Lovely. That means once we finish this last facility, we'll be finished with all of our prep work. Speaking of the, that final facility, I just got moments ago that we have permission to work on it. Awesome. What is it? We'll talk details when the time comes. It'll be great, I promise. So, tomorrow. Alright, we can do this, team. Yeah. She quit her previous job because they wouldn't let her wear pink pants, so who knows? Really? Such a it's such a strange thing, like thinking that someone's appearance affects their performance somehow. It's just, I don't know. I don't want to blame everything on boomers, but that's just like such a boomer mentality, thinking that people care. The only other people that I've known that care about that stuff is boomers. I guess let's have a browse, see what... What got added? Plus, anything else I want to order. Wait, what's this? You can search? Why did I not see that icon sooner? Oh well. It's okay, I'm browsing. What's the other style of Baobab? Oh, it's like, okay, wilted, got it. Just thinking about stuff to pick up for Alice. I 
mean... Maybe this is not a bad idea, getting one for Alice. We'll pick it up. It's fun. It'd be funny if I already got one. ideas whilst I scroll through this. I can't believe the doghouse is not something I can buy. Display stand. What must I do to get the doghouse? been useful to put in the hospital. I guess I didn't see that one. But sometimes when you're in a rush, you don't see it. Something, I want to put something at the front of a house, but it's, it's kind of hard. Because I don't know what I'm looking for, but I'll know it when I see it. I mean, would Alice ride a bike? I could probably put a bike. I already have a bike, so that's not a problem. hammock anywhere? I don't think I have a- I don't think I have a hammock. That might be an idea. Ow. Oh. I don't have one of these. I'll get one of these. My, my air conditioner, it's the important thing, so I can buy more tomorrow. So that theme really didn't give me much other furniture to be able to purchase here.
What? <laughs> Holy crap. 720,000 pokey. I, I almost feel tempted to get it. I mean, I can't buy it now, but it, this would be like something that I'd have to come here every day and exchange the currency for a while to get it. Seven hundred and twenty thousand. I think that's the most expensive thing I've seen here. Okay, I'll get a hammock because I think we're like at the bottom of the list now. Does this work? Why did I not notice there was a search feature? Hang on, we can. Oh, okay, it's just the color. Get this one. Man, how many hours in did I notice this? <laughs> anyway, that's that. As for this stuff... This one doesn't have search, that's why. Okay, I don't feel like an idiot, because this doesn't have search. So why does Happy Home have search and this doesn't? <laughs> it's so inconsistent. Okay, good, I'm not going crazy. more of these. Can't go wrong with these. Very versatile item. Alright, cool. Did I get the bottle? No, I didn't. Haha. -ha. Glowing moss statue? This is new. What is this of? Oh, it's this. Okay. Alright. Um, I guess I'll check the cafe if it has fish and chips. I don't know. I don't think it will. I'm still in disbelief that the fish they picked isn't available in summer. Mm, doesn't look like it. It's always a plate like this or sandwiches. And then either like a rice dish or a pasta dish. Ah oh, well. I'll, I'll get it eventually. At some point I'll get that island that's set in early spring. If I just keep doing the daily island thing.
At least this, this is looking nice now. Oh, that's one thing I didn't look at. was like, well, is there anything I can craft to make... ...to put in front of Alice's house? I mean, I could do this, but then I would have to lean into that. I would have to lean into it. What else have I got? This is nice, but I can't make it. Bad thing. <laughs> I have so many gold things, but I don't have the gold thing that I want. Yeah, there's not really anything big that I can make. I really want to make that. Oh yeah, I need a rocket. Huh. I don't know where I'd get that. I've already used that one. It's not going with a spooky theme. Okay. I don't know. Like, I'm not gonna force it. It's fine. As I go, I'll, I'll probably find something. But at least now, it's getting there. I just need the green mums to put here. And I guess... Hold on. Just curiosity. There was a bistro table on sale. I just don't remember if I bought it. I don't think I did. I guess it would be here if I did. Okay, so I didn't order it for nothing. Alright, that's fine. That is some lag. <laughs> is the island struggling? I might have too much stuff out. Hmm. <laughs> it seems to be struggling to render it a little bit. Okay, this is this is getting somewhere. I just need more time. And for these to actually give me the flowers I need. Too many flowers, it might be that. Well, if they made it easier to get the flowers in the first place, I wouldn't have to resort to what what is currently happening. It's taking literal months to get them. Not not even being dramatic. If you played, you'd visit the island and water the flowers for me. <laughs> That'd be a massive help. It's okay, I'll just be patient. Eventually it'll happen. I'm just looking around now and just... Forming a mental picture, so then I think about what to do next. I feel like I should do something here. I sort of started, but then I put all these flowers here, and now I've just abandoned it. I 
It's all right. There will come a time where I'll be able to get rid of, like, half of them. What flowers am I trying to get specifically? So, I need some more green mums, but at least I have them. So it's gonna they're going to fill up this area here. I need two more purple flowers. And I need blue roses. What is it? It's like purple... Oh, no, wait. I need one more purple flower. Because I do have the purple hyacinth. I'm just waiting to get more. I need purple wind flower. So I just need two flowers. I just need purple wind flower and blue rose. These... I'm at the point where they're... Yeah. I just want more of them for decoration. But I have acquired them. I'm at the point where I have enough that it's pretty easy to get them now. It's a pain in the ass to get the first one, but now that I have multiple, it'll be fine. So it's just specifically blue rose and purple wind flower. Which I, I've been trying. <laughs> I'm not doing anything wrong, at least I don't think so. Here's the tragic part. There's no way to tell if I'm doing something wrong. Like, what a brilliant idea. Because the way it works, to get blue, you need hybrid red. And to get to hybrid red... Like, let's unravel the thread. Yellow is normal yellow. But to get pink, it's not pink, it's hybrid pink. So the way you get hybrid pink... It's so involved. You get hybrid pink by mixing purple and red. So this. So the thing is, when a pink flower comes out here, it's either pink or hybrid pink. And the problem is, I don't know. There's no way to tell. Like, looking at it, you can't tell. If it's in your inventory, you can't tell. So I've made the assumption that the flowers that came out of here were hybrid pink. So I got hybrid pink. Assuming I got hybrid pink, that everything went well there. Then these ones have a chance to give me red and hybrid red. But you can't tell. It's just another case of, well, just hope they're hybrid red. And then two hybrid reds make blue. But there's no way to tell. In guides, they'll make it look darker, but in game, there's no way to tell. They look identical, and it's just... I don't know why they did that. It's just... In your inventory, at the very least, it should show, like, a symbol, like, oh, it's a hybrid red. Cool. But it doesn't. It's just... I'm hoping that I've done it correctly. I got six pinks from that side, so at least one of them should be hybrid pink. And I've gotten this many reds. I'm hoping at least a couple of them are hybrid red. It worked with the purple. The purple worked. I made the assumptions and they worked, so I don't know. Anyway. All for just a single color of flat, which I could not... I could choose not to get. I don't have to get it. This is now a completionist thing. They do the different colors horizontal, though, not vertical. Uh, I don't know. I'm not sure if the flower arrangement matters too much. From what I read, it's like it goes off adjacent tiles. I guess I haven't really done anything that has stopped me from getting the other hybrids. So I don't know. It, it's just, it's just luck. It's like the damn fly that took multiple hours when some people get it in like 10 minutes, within 10 minutes of setting up a pile of garbage. It's just, it's just my luck. It is chaotic. It is just, I swear the moment I say I'm looking for something, that's when it, I have the most problems. But if I'm not looking for something, then I'm extremely lucky. Try rearranging it and see 
if anything changes. I think I've rearranged the roses three times. <laughs> this is like the third the third version of that layout. Because I had them isolated somewhere else originally, and then I moved them there, and then I rearranged them there. It's just... Straight up, the best method is to have someone water your plants, just without question. Given what I saw of that one time, one person did it for me. That is straight up the best way. kind of nice. It encourages a social aspect to this game. Again, during the pandemic, it probably when it was at its peak, it would have been would have been fun. I had no interest in flowers back then. I didn't bother with, with them, really. see checkerboard patterns with gaps when you want to grow and horizontal base color rows. Done all I can. Hope I get them. Yeah. That's it. They will just appear one day. Just much like the green and the purple. These. Like everything you see here. Just one day both of them just appeared. So. I just gotta hang in the though. I might have to resort to time skips if I run out of stuff to do with Happy Home and I still haven't gotten them. Because then at, at that point, what do I even do if I can't finish the island? Alright, anyway, I'm leaving it here for Animal Crossing. That's it. Just Animal Crossing is ending for now. Um, Tomorrow I'll put up the stuff that I ordered, though. So. We'll do more then. Uh, but yeah, if you're watching this later on YouTube, thanks for sticking around to the end. And as always, if you want to support the content over there, just click the like button or one of the videos that pop up if you want to watch me do other things. So it helps out either way. Uh, but thank you to those that do do that. It does mean a lot. But I'll see you next time. Bye, YouTube.